Zekus here, and today we are going to be opening up a case of the new Tin of Lost Memories. So in here, there's 12 tins, and there's 36 packs in total. So let's get opening. So this set, I got this case for $200 off of eBay, which usually MSRP, if you're going to buy 12 tins like at Walmart or Target or GameStop, it's going to run you about $240. So getting about $40 off is a really good deal. I mean, when I bought the uh, tins last year, they were $240. So saved 40 bucks. So here we go. Pull it up real quick here. We got 12 tins and they look amazing. So let's pull them out here. All right, guys. So we, like we said, we have 12 of these tins we're going to open. We're going to break the seal on this one just to show you like the contents of one tin and then just to save some time, we will just go through the packs just to see all the different cards we're going to pull. So again, this is the 2020 tin of Lost Memories that came out about last week, um, August 24th, I believe. 28th. 28th. So without further ado, we're going to get into it. So before we open it up, obviously, Kaiba and Yugi on here. The epic Battle City tablet. Amazing artwork of the tin. You know, last year's, you know, it's just a gold sarcophagus. Good looking, but, you know, this one easily trumps that. So, this year they decided to do away with the promos, and we just get three Mega Packs, and they really beefed up these Mega Packs this year. There's two Super Rares in each. There's the Prismatic Secret Rare, and then there's also two Ultra Rares. Um... We are trying to pull as many Dragoon of Red Eyes as possible, along with Pot of Extravagance. And since there's two Ultra Rares, our chances of getting Dragoon are a lot higher. Than and then another thing to point out with these tins is just listen to this. They click close. Of course, it doesn't do it. They clip close. There you go. So they have like a nice seal on them, you know, so you can keep... Not that you really want to keep cards in there, but just to point that out. All right, so we're going to get into our packs here. So, first pack of 36. So, we have Basilisk Familiar of the Evil Eye. Dino Wrestlers are in here. Mord Schlag, Marincess cards, Guard Dragon cards. No Dino Wrestler. All right, so now we're at the Supers. Witchcrafter, Madam Vera. We got Firewalk, Sea Dragon. And first pack, we pulled Pot of Extravagance. This is one of the more uh, higher value cards in the set. It's around like a twenty dollar value right now. Really awesome. Gladiator Beast, and we got Infinite Track River Stomper. Vita Gladiator cards, your basic stuff. All right, so second pack: Guard Dragon, World Legacy Guardian, Tenye Spirit, Chaos Betrayer. Fury of Fire, World Legacy, Evil Eye, Firewall Dragon Dark Fluid for a super. Ooh, there you go. Magicalized Man. Fusion, Psychic Wielder, Unchained Soul, Final Light. So here's our prismatic. Set the prismatics out, I guess. Um, Final Light, Guard Dragon, Fists. Danger, Feats of Strength, Vessel, You're in Danger, and Tenny Spirit. I like seeing the Danger cards. And our danger cards are really awesome. Our all monsters. All right, so we got one more pack for this tin. Yeah, so. And then we're just going to go through the rest of the pack. So, so far for this tin, we've pulled its value already. Uh, Subterror Successor, Trickstar Fusion, Infinitrack. Dino Wrestler, I don't even know how to pronounce that card. Ten New Spirits, Mermail, um, Evil Eye Repose, uh, and we got Neos Fusion, which was recently a really expensive card to get. Now it's much better looking and cheaper. So, yay value. Um, and then we got Fusion Destiny, and for our last Ultra, we have Marincess Coral Anemone. All right, so I'll set that prismatic right here. All right, so each tin is an M MSRP of $20. Um, so in just, you know, in three just packs, in just pot yeah, of extravagance, right. we have all of our value back. What's the, what's the, um, retail um, on this card? The other cards, I'm not too sure. 
that's kind of volatile right now, but Pot of Extravagance is one of the more sought after cards. All right. We'll bring in the rest of the packs here. So we'll slide our prismatics to the side. And we have, so 33 mega packs we're gonna go through. And we're gonna try and go a little bit quicker. Yeah, so we know it. We're in the Yeah, 33, right? Oh, uh, yeah, some basic math, math there. All right. Hyper Psychic, Galactal, Dino Wrestler, Tenu Spirit, Dino Wrestler, Anga, Monk, Astra Ghouls. Actually, I like the artwork of this card. FA, Shining Star, GT, World Legacy Monastery. Oh, there you go. Mech Knight Mac Crusadia. That card has around like a $10 value right Abomination's now. Abomination's Prison, and Link Mail Archfiend for the rare. Mech Knight. Yeah, Crusadia Avermax is one of those win condition cards that is... Was recently like up around forty fifty dollars. Now it is as cheap as ten dollars. So Valkyrie, Basilisk, Time Thief, Desert Locust, Gladiator Beast, Tinny Spirit. All right, so Whitefish Salvage, uh, Test Panther, and for a Prismatic Destiny Hero Dominance. All right, not too bad. Then we got Evil Eye Defeat and Cherubini. The Eben Angel of the Burning Abyss. All right, so we're gonna set our better pulls. Where they go? Yes. Yeah, so. Astral Gold is in the better pulls, man. <laughs> well, I mean, <laughs> what, what we're really looking for personally is that pot of extravagance, Tragoon, Apollosa. World Chalice, Dino Wrestler, Marshall, Dino Wrestler, Gar Dragon, Andrake, Apple of Enlightenment, Salman Great Paro, Overburst Dragon, Pendulum Halt, Ooh, Mystic, Mystic Mind, Strength and Unity. That's one of the awesome blue eyes, eyes cards. cards. Big fan. Um, so we're gonna sit that it's one. Blue eyes and sure. Starly Safer. Oh, that's another good meta card. Yeah, actually, I was gonna say. Barred Door Blocker, Salmon Great Ring Shell, Witchcrafter Draping, Tyrant Farm, The Return to Normal, Speedious Dragon, Fusion of Fire. Pretty good pack, if I must say so myself. What's the value of Strength and Union? Um, it doesn't have too high of a value. I think I saw it like $2 or so. Still not bad. Princess, Tinny Spirit, Gladiator Beast, Dark Factory, Test Panther, Shining Star, and we got Unchained Abomination as our Prismatic. Then we got Omniburst, Brotar, and for our last Ultra, Outtrigger Extension. All right, Cap Shell. People bought that card up a lot in the past. And then a whole bunch of commons. Nothing too great with that pack. Sandy Great Wolfie, Murnsass, Dino Wrestler, Dino Wrestler, Rambiracho, Chaos Betrayer. Desert Locusts, Astra Ghouls. Ooh, Phantasme. Phantasmical Dragon, Phantasme. Sky Striker Ace. Fusion Destiny, Princess Coral. And Gorgon. Gladiator Beast, Salmon Great, Flawless Perfection Tiny, Hop Ear. Hop, Hop Ear Squadron. Squadron. You're in danger and Unchained Twins. Nice. Still have not seen that Dragoon. Starting to think he's a short print, which will make quite a lot of sense. Madark, we got Mapura, Subterra Succession, Desert Locust, Smoke of the Tenny, Guard Dragon and Drake, Firewalk Sea Dragon for a super, and Dances with Beasts. I think this is just a generic beast card. We got the Berserk Gorilla on there, pretty awesome. And then for our Prismatic, we got Rich Crafter Hein. Hein. And then we have Rich Crafter by Street. And we have Infinite Track Mountain Smasher. So nothing too great in this pack, other than maybe a Madolce Petting Sour card that no one knows how to pronounce. Trickstar Fusion, Infinite Track, Rocket Synchron, Apple of Enlightenment, Salmon Great Parrow, Salmon Great Sunlight, Marincess Blue Slug, Witchcrafter, Manam Vere. 
Ooh, IP. Another one of those Mass big meta arena. cards. A lot of people are going to be buying up. Which strike? Ooh, Dragoon of Red Eyes. Wow, he snuck in there. Red, Red, Red Eyes, Eyes Dark, Dark Dragoon. Dragoon. The artwork of this card is just amazing. And this card is absolutely freaking broken, too. Do you mean face throw monster parent controls? And if you do, just to inflict damage equal to that monster's attack. You cannot be wow. targeted or destroyed by card effects. Dragoon. And if you use both a Red Eyes and a Dark Magician, you can destroy two monsters every turn. So, pretty busted. And it is extremely accessible. The rest of that pack, Tenny oh. Spirit, Sam and Great. <laughs> Hop really. your Squadron. Hop your Squadron, yeah. Reason we bought this whole case, right? I don't know why I was thinking <laughs> Dragon is a prismatic. Marincess, Battle Ocean, Tenny Spirit, Gladiator Beast, World Legacy, Cliffhanger, Marincess, Sam and Great, Speed Lift, Super, uh, Unchained Soul of Disaster for our other Super. And then we got Shaman of the Tenny as our prismatic. Storm Dragon's Return, and Valkyrie Sexte. I don't know how to pronounce that. Uh, and then a whole bunch of, you know. Kind of What's the value of Dragon these days? Uh, he sits around a $45 to $50 value. So he is the cream of the crop for this set. Valkyrie Funst. Time Thief Flyback. Marine says Current Dark Factory of More Production. Valkyrie Chariot. Pendulum Holt. Unchained Soul of Anguish. Witchcrafter Hane. Peaceful Burial, and Witchcrafter Potier. Yeah. And then so. other Witchcrafter cards. That's our prismatic. Witchcrafter Collaboration, Gladiator, Beast, Falls, Perfection, Madolce, Pitting, Sour, Evil Eye, and Crusher on. So we have yet to see one of those Appaloza bow of the goddess. Is a very We're at one extravagance, one dragoon. So Ren Ryu, uh, draw discharge, spiritual entanglement, doom eagle. Oh, this is a dinosaur card I haven't seen in a while. Giga Spino Savete, uh, desert locusts, Shinobi Necro is our super. Princess Blue Tang is our other super, and then we got Magicalized Fusion once again as our prismatic. Uh, get out as our one of our ultras, and then Witchcrafter Holiday as our other ultra. So we're just going to skip the, the commons from here on out as they are quite <laughs> repetitive. Let's set this magical fusion right here. Mernces, Blue Tang, Gladiator Rejection, Ooh, Gallant, Gallant, Gallant Granite. Very staple card. Watcher the Evil Eye and Win, win the Win, win Champion. <laughs> That Gallant Granite is used in those Ad Emancipator decks to pretty much search any card they want. Not that they need that because of Block Dragon, but, you know. Very awesome looking card, especially in that Prismatic. So, a bottle, yeah, commons. And we got Time Thief Winder, Dances with Beasts, and we got Trickstar Corobane. Prismatic. <laughs> Successor Soul. This is another one of those uh, Blue Eyes Dark Magician cards. Look at that artwork. All Blue Eyes Dark Magician cards are the best artwork. And then we have Evil Eye Awakening. Wait, another Blue Eyes card? Yeah. What's that one do? I need another um, one. I forget. I'm going to be sure you want to affect monsters and target one effect monster you're going to control Senator Gator. Something about normal monsters. I know there's one that is a, like a skill drain type effect, which is truly awesome. Skill train. Rocket Synchron, we're skipping the commons. Beat Raptor. Beat Raptor, Infinite Track Trencher. Cyber, Cyber Quantum, Quantum, Dragon. Quantum Dragon. Well, there it is. Destined Rivals. Awesome. Destined Rivals. Witchcrafter, Subterrer, and then, more and then a Fox. See, so, yeah, we'll pull that Destined Rivals out the side here. Yeah, that the Dark Magician Blue Eyes cards. Works for both archetypes. Some epic artwork. I wonder if someone's going to mix Dark Magician and Blue Eyes and make like a Dragoon type deck or something in the near future. So, skip through the commons. We got Evil Eye Mesmerism. We got Whitefish Salvage. Uh, we got another Church Star Corobane. Uh, Infinity Track Earth Slicer and Strength and Unity. Again, not too. What's the matter that? Card? Not too uh, high, unfortunately. 
you think that usually those world premiere cards, as people call them, would be more valuable. But they're not short printed, so. <laughs> yeah, you're easy to get, I guess. Hmm, and Overburst Dragon, Infant Track, Magical Eyes Fusion, now awesome card. Okay. Memories of Hope, Peaceful Burial. Alright, we're due for something big here. Extravagance or something. Dragoon. Dragoon. Gladiator Beast. You know, skipping the commons. <laughs> Firewalk Seed. Dances with Beasts. This card is pretty common. Uh, Gizmek Yada. Witchcrafter Potier. And Evil Eye Awakening. Oh, there's the Aloof Lupine. I think that's the first time I actually saw that common. Witchcrafter Scroll, Shinobi Necro, Gizmak, Gizmak Yada, Yada Gladiator Beast, Saw the Purple. Saw the Purple. There's two Ultras, I believe, that can be fusion monsters. So we got that. Commons that we're going to skip. Marin says Blue Slug, Evil Eye Retribution. Striker Dragon as our prismatic. Haven't seen that yet. No material. Or no material. Pretty awesome. Good meta card. And we got Infinite Track. Enough okay. with these Infinite Tracks. I'm sick of them. I would rather like to have seen something else. No offense to all the Infinite Tracks. Extra Marincess. Oh, Marincess Blue Tang. Beat Raptor. World oh, Legacy one. Gar Dragon. Psychic Wielder. I feel like we haven't seen much of him. And Unchained Jason Soul. Alright, so we still got quite a lot of packs here. Um, so you never know what you're going to get out of 10. Ratios are kind of crazy. Uh, Ranru, Rising Fire, you know, Rogue of Endymion. I haven't seen him in quite a while. Um, Gladiator Beast Rejection. Pot of Extravagance. There we go. The second one. The second one of them. Followed by Infinitrack. Yeah, something we don't really care too much about, unfortunately. And then Successor Soul. Not bad. Not bad. And then, you know, commons. So we're at two Extravagance. We are at two Pot of Extravagance. World Legacy Guard Dragon and... Whitefish Salvage, Zerzeal, Dragoon, Appalooza, boom. First one of those. There we go. I was just saying. Nice. Flipped it right over. There we go. So Appalooza has around like a $20 value as well. And that is slowly kind of like on the decline. You know? That card used to be $100 for a secret rare from Rising Rampage. So very good decision by Konami to reprint it finally. So Whitefish Salvage, I think we have like 10 of these by now. Uh, Test Panther, same with Test Panther, I think we have like 20 of them, it feels like. Destiny Hero Dominance, and Star Lead Safer, and oh, I saw the purple again, man. Did not get the bump down. That uh, crazy card. I got a good feeling. Which creator creation? Sign of Mining. Oh, I saw the again. purple. Saw, seeing that purple really throws you off. Destiny Hero Dominance, Witch Creator, oh, Infinite man. Track. Yeah, so there, there's just so many good reprints in this set. Highly recommend picking these up at like, you can even just buy a couple tins, they're really crazy. So we got Evil Eye Repose. Uh, Marincess Seahorse, IP Mascarena, second one of those, epic card, uh, Psychic Wielder, and then Unchained Soul of Rage. All right, so we'll sit that IP. This card looks so good. We got three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine packs left. Which creator creation? Valkyrie Erda, Trickstar. Fusion Destiny, Coral Anatomy. Oh, 
Alright, nice pack. Let's get more than one Dragoon in this case. Can we do it? Marinces cards. Dr Guard Dragon cards are all in here, you know. Marinces Blue Slug, Evil Eye, Re Retribution, Gizmic Yada. Looks a little bit like the Winged Dragon. Storm Dragon's Return. Can we do it? Ah, oh, get out. Can okay, obviously tell us to get out. Astra Ghouls, F.A. Shining, Shaman of the Tenny, Memories of Hope. All right, Dragoon right here. <laughs> Skip to the supers. Zerazeal, Shinobi Necro, Sky Striker Ace. First time seeing this one, I believe. Infinite Track Earth Slicer. Can we do it? Can we do it? No, we cannot. Strength and Unity, <laughs> taunting us with those good cards. What's up, please? Like Strength that. and Unity, we got. Only one of the um, deaths and rivals, though. I like the same. best card that they made for the Blue Eyes Dark Edition decks. Marin says Seahorse. Of course. Which character creation? Ooh, Crackdown. Crackdown. Infinitrack. Infinitrack. Successor, successor Soul. Soul. That's a place that is Successor Soul. All right, guys. We have four more packs. Anything can happen with these tins. Can we get another... Red Eyes Dark Dragoon. Can we do it? Two more. Let's get two more, yeah. Three more, right? <laughs> Trick's time. Utopic Dark Infinity. Evil Eye Retribution. Dragoon Knight Romulus. Witchcrafter by street. street. Witchcrafter. Marincess Seahorse, Marincess Marine Cess Blue Tang, I've been saying it wrong, Destiny Hero Dominance, Salmon Great Pyro Phoenix, Ooh, Mech, Mech Knight, Knight Crusadia, not bad, White Aurora, Monosaurus, Monosaurus, alright, second to last pack, let's do it, Salmon Greats, Gladiator Ejection, Time Thief Winder, Unchained Abomination, Abomination's Prison, and Witchcrafter by Street. You know, they need to get rid of these Witchcrafter cards and start adding in more Dragoons. Last pack. I didn't realize Dragoon was that hard to pull, though. I saw a case opening and someone got three of them. Gladiator Beast, Rising Fire, Guard Dragon, Boral Load, World Legacy, we did it. Last Red Eyes pack. Dragoon. I Woo! was feeling it. Fusion Destiny. And, you know. There it is. So. All right. Quick recap. We pulled two Red Eyes Dark Dragoon, two Pot of Extravagance. We only got one Appalosa, two IPs, one Mystic Mine, two Avermax. We got three of the... A play set of both Successor Soul and Strength and Unity, the, the new two of the new world premiere cards. But we only pulled one of the Destined Rivals, which is like the really good trap card. Um, we only got one Sign at Mining as well as only one uh, Phantasme, which those are supers. So they're like short print super rare cards. So overall, we did not pull a Boral Load Savage Dragon, which is one of the higher valued cards. Um, obviously, Red Eyes Dark Dragoon being the highest value around like $50. So, overall, I think we did really well with this opening, but maybe we could have done a little bit better. Um, obviously, pulling two $50 cards, I say that and being really greedy. But make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe, and catch us later on our next upcoming videos. Thanks for watching. All the cards we open will be on our eBay store. We'll put the link in the description. Uh, make sure you guys follow us on our socials. Team Zekas on Instagram. We post a lot of daily content. Um, and make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe for more Yu-Gi-Oh! videos.